Six Reasons Why Electricity in Kenya Is So Expensive Before we begin, go to PowerAfriCastle.com to find out what the doctor ordered for high electricity bills and power blackouts in Kenya. Electricity in Kenya tends to be relatively expensive due to a combination of factors, including 1. Limited energy sources. Kenya relies heavily on hydroelectric power, which can be inconsistent due to fluctuations in rainfall. Additionally, the country has been working on diversifying its energy mix, including geothermal and wind power, but these projects require substantial investment and time to develop. 2. High initial investment costs. Building infrastructure for power generation and distribution requires significant initial investment. These costs are often passed on to consumers through electricity tariffs. Remember to check out PowerAfriCastle.com to eliminate your electricity bills in Kenya. 3. Infrastructure Challenges Maintaining and expanding the electricity grid in Kenya can be costly due to the vast geographic areas and challenging terrain, especially in rural areas. These challenges contribute to the overall cost of electricity provision. 4. Fuel Costs In cases where non-renewable energy sources are used, such as diesel generators, the cost of fuel can significantly impact electricity prices. Fluctuations in global oil prices can therefore affect the cost of electricity in Kenya. 5. Transmission and Distribution Losses Kenya experiences losses in electricity transmission and distribution, which can be attributed to technical issues, theft, and inefficiencies in the system. These losses contribute to higher costs for both providers and consumers. 6. Policy and Regulatory Environment The regulatory environment and policies regarding electricity generation, transmission, and distribution can also impact costs. In some cases, regulatory frameworks may not be optimized for efficiency, leading to higher costs for consumers. Efforts to address these challenges include investing in renewable energy sources, improving infrastructure, enhancing energy efficiency measures, and implementing policies to promote competition and transparency in the energy sector. However, these efforts often require time, resources, and sustained commitment from both the government and private sector stakeholders. After listening to this podcast, most people go to PowerAfriCastle.com to get a quote on installing solar in Kenya.